Hello everybody, um, this is Cacti and Carnivores here, and today, um, today we're going to be witnessing um, the start of a new series. Uh, now this is going to be like the Venus fly flytrap plant log I've been doing, um, except it's going to be a little bit more significant. Um, instead of buying seeds and just growing them and seeing what, how they do, I'm going to be attempting to cross-pollinate two separate um, cultivars of Venus flytraps and then documenting the growth patterns and the development of the seedlings that arise from that cross. Um, this may not work. Um, I might just like fail at pollinating and screw everything up. Um, so if that happens, then I'll probably notify of you notify you in the future. Um, but now I have three flowers open. I got two typicals. I got one maroon monster right here. Um, so the thing is here that um, the timing. I didn't notice that the timing on these is going to be such a like a weird thing because the thing is that there's these three flowers and they'll all be receptive at different times. So if I, if this can focus, doesn't want to focus, alright, nice. Um, there's a little thing in the center right there and that's called, I think it's called the pistil or the stigma. I'm not, the flower anatomy is just a little weird, weird for me, but there's a thing in the center and there's things on the outside and you gotta get stuff from the outside into the center to get it to make seeds. And the thing on the center takes a, while, a day or two to open. And as you can see, this one's opened, and the thing in the center, you see that little red thing in the center? It's red for the maroon monster. Um, it hasn't opened, because um, uh, that thing in the center hasn't developed because the flower just opened, so it's going to take a little while. Um, so, and these have opened a little, little bit late. This one's kind of old. This one's relatively maturing. Um, yeah, so the pollen, I'm going to do a simple couple of crosses, but um, I'm going to do some ones after, but right now I'm just going to show you the basic process. Um, I'm going to get some of the pollen from here. If I can, I don't see any pollen. And I'm going to put that onto here, the 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 flower. So I have to be very, very careful at this point. Now this might not be too interesting to look at. It's a, it's a bit tedious. It requires some care, some effort. And I might not even be getting any pollen properly on. Um, but yeah, that's the basic process. I will do more pollinations as much as I can. Um, and once that happens, I'll document the seed pods. Um, and yeah, and if I get seeds, then I'll sow them and everything will go from there. The rest will be history. Uh, yeah, so that's basically that. This is a little prologue um, for this the, the future to come. Um, not really the first... Well, I, I guess you could say it's the first, um, the start of this, uh, data log, whatever you want to say. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty much everything. Um, hopefully some seeds, I'll get some seeds in the future, and goodbye.